Hello, you sexy biscuits, and welcome into Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Silence, you children of gods, and heed my tale of time's beginning. All was dark. There was no sand. There was no sea, no earth, nor sky, no grass, nor wind. Till fire met ice in the gasping void. And from this green came the giant Ymir. First of all beings. Proud Ymir cruelly killed. Yet from whose bones and blood and brains the world was made. The world you walk and war upon. There you are. Okay, so this is the first game I'm properly playing on Xbox Series X, <laughs> which is a big thing. Um, yeah, right now this looks great. Um, very nice. I'm very excited about this Assassin's Creed because I haven't actually looked that deeply into it. So it's all quite new to me. Oh, wow. Hey, well, here's a tune for you. Want to liven your step? Oh, it's so interesting because... The amount of people right now reminds me of Unity. God, that's so bloody detailed. Oh, there you are, my little drinker. Go. So, you see how came? Yes, good. Come here. Uh, did you find the, the ring? Yes. No. Plan. You see her talking, quiet as a wood mouse, and surprise him with our gift. You hold it out, like this, you look him in the eyes and you say, Stirbjörn King, may our clans be forever bonded in friendship and in love. I think you can do that for me. Good. Tonight, you will be the court that unite our people. I'm so proud of you. I like that you can't really tell the gender of the child, because of course you can play as female or male. So they have kind of a good middle ground here, that's awesome. So nice having all of these hearty folk in our I can dance! <laughs> that's so cool! Do 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 God, graphically, this is insane. What you're seeing right now is, is 1080p at 60, but um, yeah, I'm viewing this at 4K and god damn, it's beautiful. YouTube's probably gonna ruin it, but uh, wow. I'll always say that Assassin's Creed Unity is the most beautiful Assassin's Creed still. Oh, no drink in your fist? Come on, I'll find you something. I can't. I have a tip for your father. Oh, what a piece! That must be worth two sturdy long chips. Give it here, I'll pass it on. My father asked me, Sigurd. Suit yourself. But you're not getting any mead. But as you can see, this game is really pretty. As long as he doesn't have the um, pop in of characters and clothing like Unity did. This is going to be great. Oh, so I just threw the ball up in the air. <laughs> oh, wow, the lighting. Like, okay, I can't wait to play this on my big TV, but uh, currently I'm playing this through my computer monitor. Um, But, wow. Hold it up to the light. Show him the fine details. See there? I etched his name in runes on the outer band. You'll show him? Mm -hmm. You're just like your father, little berserker. 
Skull to you. Skull! You see? She agrees. I like how I wasn't even bloody concentrating on the guy at all. That's amazing. <laughs> so, you have the ring? Good. This was worn by your grandfather in a battle on the northern way. Mother? Yes. Can we show us to get the can stones we stacked yesterday? That's a good idea. That's in the morning. First light. <laughs> Their mother reminds me of Aloy from, um, oh, that PS4 exclusive. She looks very like Aloy. That's really weird. Okay. Skull! To Stormwell! The true king of Brugafolga! Tonight, we are all made anew! Skull! Ah. Ava. Ava. King. May our clans be forever bonded in friendship and love. <gasps> Thank you, Eivor. Now and forever, I am pledged to you. <laughs> Hearken well in Hall of Kings. Ah. On ocean steed, my words gain wings. All oh, then speed our forth will bring For noble deeds that honor sing The brave men slain, Valkyrie awakes Rewards for strain to our little takes And horns for sound the mighty horn Oh no. Ready yourself, men! Ah. Go. Not you, Ava. Not just yet. I'm not actually going out there, am I? Okay. <laughs> Have I got a tiny little wooden sword to use or something? The curtains are raised. Nothing is true until it is severed from the branches of Yggdrasil. Oh my god. Oh wow. Oh, nice cutscene transition. That was quite clean. Oh. I'm going to say the in-game quality actually looks slightly better than the cutscene. I think that's the first time I've ever seen that. Oh god, it's like Kingdom Come Deliverance all over again. Okay. <laughs> Quick, Henry, protect Scarlet! Oh! Oh! Nice! <laughs> Bloody humans! If 
I give my life, will you spare my clan? You have my word. No. No, Varen. No, Varen! Pick up your axe! Oh, no. He's obviously not telling the truth. No! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> yep. Didn't see that one coming, eh? Did they literally just copy the intro to Kingdom Come Deliverance? <laughs> oh no. Oh. I still can't get over the bloody graphics. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. Oh, I am. Oh, I don't like that. Wow. This is what I was expecting from next gen, honestly. This is crazy, and this isn't even like a full next gen game. It's kind of in that middle ground. Oh, God! This intro is insane. Oh, is that the Animus? <laughs> what? What the hell is that? I'm seeing two different data streams overlapped in the same DNA. Not sure why. Fix this or pull me out. I can parse the streams with a filter. Hold on. Okay, we're good. Are we? I don't know what happened, but I can work around it. You'll have to pick a stream to keep things stable. There's a third option, too. I can let the Animus modulate your identity based on signal strength. It's up to you. Oh, right. So let the Animus choose. I'm gonna go for female. The Animus will represent the stronger female or male memory stream, depending on its current strength. Very confusing. Okay. Um, so we can be male, or we can play as female. I'm gonna play as female. All right, I'll lock it in and push ahead to a time where these streams are more synchronized. I really want Cassandra back from Odyssey. <laughs> Bloody love Cassandra. How long have you been chasing me, Wolf Kissed? 17 winters? 18? Do I now haunt your dreams? Do I warm your loins? <laughs> You remember this? Oh, your father's axe. The weapon of a coward. A scorn snake. Ah, few things would please me more than to kill with this blade. But I know you would defy me to the death, fighting for a glorious end. That I will not allow. You will live your final days enthralled as a slave, humiliated. Your death will be a lonely one. <laughs> Kill the rest of our crew! Make them suffer! Ava Wolfkiss is no more! That name is dead to this world! My name is Ava Wolfkiss? Oh my god, that's the most badass name in the world. <laughs> You move, and I take your eyes, you hear me? Wind's blowing from the south. We can tack north, then cut west. Now what did I just tell you? <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, nice. <laughs> Oh, he went into the bloody cage. Oh, wow. Shut uh, I will skin you alive. Uh, you will never, never leave this. Uh, boot to the face, because you're too late. <laughs> and we're in gameplay. Oh, yeah, she's um heavily wounded. Okay. Uh... Wow. Oh, this is stunning. Okay. Oh, look at the snow deformation. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's really fancy. Oh. Oh, that's oh, that's lovely. Okay. Um, could I uh scan? Is that a thing you can still do? I think it's been brought back quite a bit from what I've read. Definitely doesn't give you destinations as easily as in Odyssey, because in Odyssey you can literally see through bloody walls. Um Oh, that's really nice. I love that effect. Let's grab all this. Okay, health regeneration. Eating wild berries, mushrooms, and food. Cool. When fully healed, collected food is stored to create rations. Oh, okay. That's really bloody nice. Okay, let's get up here. Let's grab some more of this stuff when we're here. Oh, here we go. Climb. Ah, oh, there you go. Classic Assassin's Creed climbing. They definitely have kind of brought it back a little bit, because before you had to hold down on RT and... And then press A to do jumps and stuff. I really liked it in Revelations. That was probably my favourite form of parkouring. Uh, apart from Unity. Unity had the really nice kind of downward free running, which was unique. They've definitely scaled back the parkour, which is a bit unfortunate. Because now it's just hold A and push forwards, which is, um, yeah, a little bit different. But that was the case for Odyssey and Origins, I'm pretty sure. So online I've been seeing a lot about this being a RPG, uh, which I'm not too sure about. <laughs> um, it'd be interesting to see, and if there's um, dialogue choices and, and character development, that would be really, really cool. Right, let's synchronize, I guess. Ah, doesn't get old, does it? <laughs> Where that oath breaker is holding my crew. Okay, you ready? <laughs> Caw! Oh, oh, no, that... Okay. <laughs> I didn't think that worked. <laughs> oh, God, the water's freezing. Okay, that kind of makes sense. Right. Okay, let's find and rescue my crew. Yeah, you can't parkour downhill, can you? So if I was to go up here and try and run down, she just jumps, which is um, probably not the best way to do that. Oh, hang on. We got enemies over there. Could I uh I need to be careful. You know what? Let's uh let's take down our first guy here. Let's come up behind him and go for a stealth kill. Lock target. Okay. Come up behind him. Is there a stealth takedown or is it just a push a button? Okay, I'm just going to push a button. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> what? I just chopped off his arm. Right, okay. Um, I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Uh, call Raven. Stretch your wings, Sunan. How far can we go with a bird until it needs to load? Because in Odyssey, if you went too far, when you came back to your body, it would have to load. Um, I want to see how quickly that happens with... Of course, the um, the SSD that's in here. Okay, let's let's pull back. Wow. Yeah, that's impressive. Okay, someone commented on my channel yesterday saying, "Who cares about the load times?" I do. Uh, the the quicker you can get into a game and play it, the better. Why wouldn't you care about that? Um, it's something that's. Not only allowing us to play the games we love quicker, like the old days where you put in a cartridge and it would be immediately playable, but also it, it's great for being able to quick resume and stuff like that. I really love it. I think it's um, a good step forward and I think it's time that consoles needed SSDs because for the longest time now we've had consoles with, with bog standard hard drives that have been absolutely awful. The PS3, the last PS3 they released, had a awful, awful hard drive in it. To the point where if you had Uncharted 3 installed on it, it would actually stutter. 
Um, and I had to sell that PS3 because of it. Um, <laughs> yeah, that was a thing. Now, names I'm awful with. So let's just say Kajote's commands. Um, Ricky Wolf, prepare the child of Varin for the slavers. You may use the others for blood sacrifice. Fucking <laughs> you know, hell. Okay. <laughs> oh. Let's grab this when I'm in here. Oh, nice. Uh, now, I'm guessing we have the loot system, like in Odyssey, where you have all these different colored items, and it was... You'd be constantly changing your gear every three seconds. All right, let me get into that grass down there. That'd probably be the best idea, right? Oh, damn. The lighting in this game is stunning. Heavily guarded? Hmm. now taste the slaver's whip. And with Prince Sigurd likely lost at sea. Did he just say Sigismund? Oh my god, this is Kingdom Come Deliverance. Right, um... Now, I want them to split up. There you go. Right, let's go for this guy first. Yeah, he's out of the way. Let's go for a headshot here. I don't even know if this is going to be a headshot, but... Here we go. Nice. Okay. That, that felt good. That felt really nice, actually. Plus... It doesn't seem to be... Oh, that is awesome. It doesn't seem to be limited like in um, Odyssey. Because in Odyssey, you could only kill people if your weapon was at the right level. And it felt completely unrealistic. This feels a lot more realistic. A headshot should be an instant death. And I'm glad that's the case here. Yeah, I'm, I'm liking this so far. The opening is one of the best I've seen in an Assassin's Creed game. Um, I'm one of those people who didn't like the opening to Assassin's Creed 2. Because it was really slow um sure it built up character development for um Ezio, but i want to get into a game like this there is fighting nearby i want to get to the good stuff and start playing you know Zag, you old hound you live i do slipped away in the sword clash and what of you Chodvit tried to sell me off. A mistake he'll regret. Not today he won't. I saw him board a ship at Aval's Nest not long ago. Sailed east, leaving our crew behind. There must still be time to save our men. I will find them. You ready the longship. You glory hound. You would take the rescue for yourself, so the victory song is written about you. I could storm the beach then. Slay two dozen men, seize our dragon boat, and hoist the sail in triumph. Up to you. No, no, I will take the beach. A far more dangerous path. You search the longhouse for our crew. Oh, and here. This corpse will not have need of it. Go. I'll meet you by the ship. Oh, okay. That looks like a pretty big camp. Okay, I'm guessing we now can go to our inventory and install that shield. Um, let's put that on my second hand. Oh, we could have another, we could have another axe. Okay, let's put that on there. On this hand, we can have this. Oh, so it's a little bit different. Uh, I don't have any kind of DLC stuff, do I? <laughs> no, I don't, okay. Right, let's get in here. The shield is actually now its own separate item. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Was that a thing in Odyssey? I don't think it was, was it? Right, let's uh, come down here then. I'm expecting it's going to put us into combat and actually not let us sneak here because it wants to teach us. Uh, when in close proximity to wealth, mysteries, or artifacts, the location will begin to pulse. Well, let's go have a look at that then. Chodvis warriors crawl through Arval's nest like lice. If I use the main gate... May attract attention. And that's exactly why we're not using the main gate, because I'm not stupid. Um, let's find a way around the side. Oh, hang on a bloody second. There's a way in here. All right. Okay. Longhouse. My crew should be inside. Sneakily does it. Attack. Okay, well, he's definitely dead. Now, did anyone hear that? No! Okay, we're clear. God, I'm just looking at the textures on the roof here. You see all the different tiles? That's really nice. Climb down. Okay, right. Now, are we going to land on someone if we do this? I squirm like that, and my axe will miss your neck. Unpleasant for both of us. If I'm to die, I want to make a mess of it, Bakraut. Could I um, literally just jump on this guy? Right, let me... Oh, God. Okay, that's it. Climb down here. Oh, 
The animations are really nice. You coward! Unbind me and stick an axe in my hand! I owe you nothing, raven shit. Yours is a clan of thralls and peasants. You! Lay that axe aside or die by mine! Oh, here we go. You should be on a slave ship to Ireland, Wolfkist. But if you wish to be my first sacrifice, Odin will be more than happy to receive you. You just killed yourself, Erki. All right, lock target. Okay, he's going to go for a unblockable attack. Let's dodge that and then come in for our own. Now, I'm assuming he's going to be quite difficult. Oh, nice. Oh, dodge that one. Oh, that's so cool. Let's come in for another attack here and get out of the way because obviously stamina. Yeah, stamina definitely takes a role in this game, which is um interesting. I don't know if that was a thing in um Odyssey, was it? Oh, God. Okay, move. Nice. Okay. Don't get hit. <laughs> I'm try and not get hit. Let's save our stamina. Nice. Okay. And then come in for another hit. Oh, no. Okay. Dodge out of the way. Stamina back up. Oh, we took one hit. Okay. I was trying to do that without getting hit once. Oh, God. Okay. Moving. Go for another hit here and back up. Oh, he's got out different weapons. Okay. They're a lot quicker now. Oh! Okay, so we can parry. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay, I need to get that timed properly because um, I'm not very good at it. <laughs> let's uh, let's try that again. No, see? I was, I was off. Oh, there you go. And that kind of puts you into slow motion. Okay. That's it. Hit me. Stop trying to hit me and hit me. Oh, nice. Yeah, that feels really good. And then, stun attack. Oh! Oh! Father, you should have held on to this until the bitter end. If I give my life, will you spare my clan? Let it no! Pick up your axe! Kill them all! No! Okay. Um. Right. Uh, what have I taken? <laughs> Here we go. Follow the wolf and that guy. Uh, right. Um, yeah, they weren't lying when Jack said his beanstalk was really bloody big. Abel, are you bewitched? Unbind us. What? Oh, yes, of course. Yeah, sure. Um, let me just use my axe. <laughs> Ooh! W one second, I need to dress myself. Give me a second. Um, oh, I got a really cool outfit. Let's put that on. Oh, wow. Okay, tunic. Yes. Uh, this here. Nice. Where did I get this from? Did I get this from the dream that I was just in? <laughs> that makes no sense. Uh, let's take Varen's axe. And we could also have the other axe in that hand. That's nice. I like that. Hmm. I'll see. I'll, I'll keep the shield for now. Okay, let's uh, let's help this guy out. Equip your retrieved armor set in the menus. We've literally just done that. Uh, open the cage. Here we go. And reach our longship. Right, okay. Let's go to our longship then. And then we'll probably end the episode. I've liked this so far. This has been really nice. Oh, okay. That was an instant battle situation. Okay. Right, let's uh, let's see what we got here. <laughs> Come on. Someone go for the attack. Go Come on. Okay, I still need to get that bloody block down. It's slightly delayed. It's weird. Oh, there you go. 
Oh, nice. Blocked it. It's just getting the timing down is what I'm going to have to get used to. Like, like that. Stun attack. Oh, how is that a stun attack? That's a decapitation attack. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Oh, bloody stun. I, I need to get better at that, goddammit. Okay. Oh. Parry. Parry. There you go. Right. Oh, no, that's, no, that's gruesome. Ah. Okay. Let's just take these when I'm here. Oh, I chopped off his arm. He's dead. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, bloody hell! Are you sure that I'm not secretly a god? Like, holy crap. Also, do you have any other finishing moves? <laughs> Here we go. Oh, wow. Yeah, the uh, the combat does feel nice. It's all about getting that timing down. It's something that I'm going to have to uh, kind of practice at. But apart from that, I'm really liking this. God, <laughs> You're very arm happy today. Um, is that a bad guy? No, okay. Oh, this bloody guy. Look, look can you just die already? <laughs> Thank you. Can I sneak here? Oh, I can. Okay. Let's come up behind this guy. I wish that there was a, a takedown button. It's kind of weird that there isn't. You just kind of have to attack and hope that it kills them. Hmm, I'm not sure I like that. Okay. Uh, find a way to enter and destroy the lock. Rooftop, I guess? Right? No? Huh. Is there another entrance? Maybe through the window? Oh, there's a guy there. Need to be careful here. Let's, uh... Let's go up on here. There we go. Right. Geronimo! No, I, <laughs> that didn't work. I thought that was going to work. Oh, suck it. I think I just broke his shield as well. That was brilliant, right. Coming through the window. Through the wall. Okay. Ooh, loot chest. Ooh, carbon ingot. I don't know what the hell that is, but awesome. Am I not supposed to destroy this? Oh, there you go. There you go. I opened the door. Well done, me. All right, let's uh, get to the longbow and then uh, get the hell out of here. Oh, God. Okay, we got some uh, enemies here. That's not good. Oh, right in the face. Nice. Okay. Bow and arrow feels really nice. Okay. Let's uh, come behind this guy and just wreck him. There you go. I'm not very good at this combat thing, are you? Okay. Really? I can play that. <laughs> very fancy. Oh, we both hit each other at the same time. That was amazing. on. Nice. Nice. These small guys, you can just go through like no one's business. This is really, really nice. Okay. And here is our... Oh. Oh, that water looks nice. Oh, that water looks nice. Is that a little bit of like froth when it comes up the uh, beach there? Ah, oh, wow. I mean, Odyssey wasn't a slouch when it came to his water, but uh... That does look really pretty. Okay. Let's get in here. Open sail. There we go. And then follow coast. Oh, so it does it automatically. That's nice. Okay. Cinematic camera. Rather silent, Eivor. Anything to say for the mess you led us to? We suffered no losses in this fight. And the men who humiliated us are dead. What is there to say? Oh, something like, I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind, boneheaded, and I smell like blood and shit? I like my version better. Eivor, look! Someone is setting up an outpost on that island. Shut this men. Gnawing at any piece of open land like dogs worrying a bone. Even with you half in the grave, we could easily take them. And that is where I'm going to end, because I want you guys to experience this for yourself. I really, really like this. I think it's fantastic. The opening of this game was absolutely amazing. Um, graphically, it's 
stunning. I can't wait to put this on my big 4K TV and just take in all the bloody details. Um, but yeah, I'm really bloody impressed with this. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, comment down below and leave a like. And um, yeah, I will see you guys soon. Thank you so much for watching. But until next time, that's me. Out. Bye, guys. What's up?